Hey everyone, it's Brooklyn and today's an update about my corset training. So today I'm wearing my 301. So my fingers cannot figure out what one was apparently, but so far it has been gone, going really well. I can definitely tell there's a lot like... Okay, so here is like one of the things that I've known the corset training is starting to work. I was wearing a tank top at work while opening and one of my coworkers has said to me, wow, your waist, you're definitely having more of an hourglass shape. So, the people are definitely being able to tell more and my friends and my family are actually, and people, coworkers too, are actually starting to come around and be like, hey, how's it going? They're actually starting to get into it and not so on the off stance side of it. So, that's actually pretty well. So, I can wear my corset now for about eight hours if I want to. Excuse me, sorry. I can wear it for eight hours if I want to, which is really awesome because I want to start wearing it more and more and for longer periods of time because why not? Like, I'm getting into this. I want to wear it all the time. It definitely makes me feel sexier. Definitely makes me feel like more confident in everything and I love it. And it's really great with styling with outfits too. Like, I got a little bit more into the fashion with it, so that's going really well and my breathing with it on I can honestly say has really approved because before I could tell it did trick my breathing just a little bit because obviously you're tightening on your lungs so your breathing is restricted but now my lungs have really gotten used to it and I can breathe a whole lot better with it so that's a thumbs up but what I really like I've been trying to start wearing it more often, get it, like get more into it because I kind of fell off just a little bit because especially last week I was working so much, my time was so consumed and corset training is really hard for me when I work 12 hour days, I wake up, go to work, go to work again, come home and then I just want to sleep and I don't want to sleep in my corset because I'm really afraid of bending the steel bones in it so I don't sleep in it so I skipped a few days and I did feel the difference in my confidence when I did that and how I felt about my body and the way that I ate definitely did change a little bit so I can definitely tell with wearing my corset my eating habits are better than when I don't wear it so that's something other thing about when you're wearing it you get used to eating habits and when you don't wear it then you start eating differently again like when I wear it, I feel like I actually eat meal portions. When I don't wear it, I feel like I snack a lot more. So I definitely do feel like the fact of wanting to eat right, it definitely does help with that. So I really like that. And another thing with the 301, I have to tighten it abo up above a little bit more than the bottom part, but that's okay. I am the A shape in the 301 but in my 201 I am just a straight bone so each corset can fit you differently to your body so if it's not completely straight that could just be the way that your body shaped to that certain kind of corset so definitely do remember that my friend actually has the same thing with her 301 and it's because we're smaller up here than we are at her hips we have mother bearing hips which they call it so <clears throat> and that's kind of what I have noticed with wearing it and I really quite enjoy it so that is this week's update I hope everybody has a great day and bye